how your robot partner participates in any kind of intimate acts with you suppose you tell your robot partner tell your love robot to move its hands to some particular parts in your body and it obeys your command Before we proceed, let me tell you one thing. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. It means a lot to me. And if you have already subscribed, lots of thanks for your support. How does it do that? How it happens? How this magic happens? Let us discuss that topic in today's video. And something many more. First of all, let me tell you one thing about the unsung heroes of Humanet Robotics. It is called microcontrollers or MCUs. They act as a distributed nervous system that handles low-level real-time operations. A lab robot will have numerous MCUs, each dedicated to a specific function. For example, an MCU in a robotic arm receives high-level commands such as move hand to position in that body part or kind of things okay kind of instructions from a central computer that means through its senses It then translates this command into the precise time electrical signals needed to orchestrate the various servo motors within that limb, that means hands, ensuring smooth and accurate movement. And it happens uh, so smoothly that you won't understand how does it do that, how how does this magic happen but this is the way this type of magic happens through microcontrollers or MCUs It also uh, happens in such a way there are some hardware software and algorithm uh, perspective also this hierarchical control system is a cornerstone of modern robotics and embedded system from a hardware perspective it involves designing compact efficient circuits that integrates uh, MCUs with sensors like position encoders and actuators actuators are actually motors in software this necessitates writing lean firmware for the MCUs often using a real-time operating system or RTOs to guarantee immediate responses to commands and sensor feedback and if you think about uh, the algorithms algorithmically MCUs execute fundamental control loops like PID controllers to manage motor position, speed, and torque with high fidelity. This allows the central computer to focus on complex algorithms for navigation and decision making, making the entire system more efficient and responsive. And that is how the whole intimate acts take place with your robot partners. And this is uh, not a child's play. I like add here because after all you whenever you buy a lab robot there are reasons for that because I 
presume that in your case the human relationship is not working anymore and you are searching for ai companion and you find your mental peace lost peace and tranquility in your life through your love robots and in that case these microcontrollers are the i again repeat unsung heroes of humanoid robotics because i again repeat that <coughs> sorry that it is acting actually as a distributed nervous system okay and it is a cornerstone of modern robotics and embedded system without which you cannot expect any kind of physical activities that means they cannot move their limbs they cannot stretch their legs or lift their legs or bend their legs or hands or use their hands for any kind of uh, intimate touch or something like that they cannot do that without this mcus and this mcus act as in fact uh, like uh, it, it is directly acting with the low level uh, part of the robots that means real time operations it, it handles the real time operations and also uh, does everything that needed to perform and participate in any kind of physical activities with you without any glitch without any malfunction so that is the secrets of the participation how they participate in any kind of intimate acts with you and gives you the satisfaction and pleasure you are searching for with your human partner so that is it thank you for joining us on this journey let's continue this conversation in the comments below if you like the video please hit the bell icon to get notified and don't forget to like with your friends share and subscribe for more insights if you have already subscribed tons of thanks for your support it means a lot to me and please consider signing up for membership zone to support wooden slate so that we can make it better and better see you in the next video till then goodbye take care and stay safe